collective flowers, flowers, flowers. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Mm -hmm. my channel this is Adana also known as the Afro Zen today I'm reading for the beautiful handsome collective hey collective hey <laughs> flowers 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 <clears throat> don't forget to like share subscribe hit that notification bell to book a private reading with me or to shop in my store all that information is in the description box below all right so let's get into it I just want to share <laughs> this here <laughs> this is from Aldi's. Yo, oh my God. This, this has my heart forever. <laughs> I just wanted to share that. <laughs> Alright, so let's get into it. Good spirit, a. Hmm. Mm. I'm hearing affliction. Affliction. Let's see. Wow, misery, sorrow, pain, distress. <laughs> okay. you know <laughs> that someone is going through complete sorrow <laughs> and pain and affliction i'm sorry oh but i'm not this is the karmics we're talking about of course uh i guess we just want me to talk about their karma you know <laughs> so okay <laughs> and while they're suffering in silence or <laughs> They soon to suffer out loud publicly. <laughs> we have compassion as well, but it's in reverse. So, <laughs> so you gonna be celebrating and you know hanging with a good time, a great time, and they gonna be um suffering in their sorrows. <clears throat> Oh man, <laughs> can't get away from this shit, bruh. I swear. <laughs> They're drowning in their pain and their sorrow for what they've done. It's too much to handle, it's too much to bear. <laughs> you got accountability here. The universe is. Um, literally pushing accountability onto them like they have to sit and they have to go through their karma <clears throat> they're actually um, so there are extended people extended family members that are actually turning on this nuclear family or you know, the family or the group dynamic that started all of this, the outsiders or the extended family no longer wants um, to deal with this. Yeah, and it's blowing. Yeah, look, it's blowing up. We have volcano in the tree. Um, you're going to be very shocked, 
by who's standing by your side. Like, you'll be like, really? Like, there's a lot of people that are aware of what's going on and they're taking your side. I don't want to say take your side, but they're standing by your side because they're realizing everything that you've been saying is the honest truth. It's the honest truth because some of them actually went through it as well, too. So you also had extended family members as well um, that may, and they're going to resonate for everybody, of course, but for the ones that do resonate with the, some, of, some of the extended family members may have been afraid or just silent in speaking because they thought that they were the only one that went through <clears throat> what they went through with this family dynamic here. But a lot more people are going to be coming out and speaking up and out in regards to what they experienced with that family or that group dynamic. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Justice. So what Spirit is showing me right now, Spirit is showing me a person, just a person, just more so the collective. You're standing in the middle and you're just surrounded by these, uh, you're surrounded by other souls. Just hear me out here. You're surrounded by other souls, but they're white. And no one can penetrate this um, barrier that these souls, um, so it's like a circle and you're in the middle you're completely safe. You're completely protected. And they're chanting the word love. And you know what's so funny? <sighs> I was in a meditation last night. And when I said it was so fucking beautiful, like I did not want to come out of it. And all, all I kept saying was love, 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 love. Like that's all I kept saying. And every time I say it, I just drift, drift deeper into this meditation and it felt so it felt so safe it felt so warm warm hot but not like a hot like a hot hot but just enough warmth where you feel cozy or I felt like I was like in the bosom of the universe like that's just how I felt and it just it felt so good <laughs> so that's what I'm seeing the collective in the middle or person in the middle and there's like white energies around it or around you and they are protecting this is barrier so no one can can do anything can say anything like if they say something it'll bounce back so it's like a electromagnetic field in that kind of way but of energies around okay so it could be your ancestors it could be the universe god whoever however okay <clears throat> They're in so much trouble. <laughs> They're in so much trouble. <laughs> we got mushroom. <laughs> mushroom. <laughs> Perspective. And um, <laughs> they're feeling... They're really they're feeling victimized because the perspective has changed on them. <laughs> so people are like, yo, did you hear about such and such? Yeah, I heard you heard too. Yeah. You know that happened to me too. And in some kind of way, really? That happened to you? Yeah. Well, when I was talking to them or when I was around them, this happened to me. Like in that kind of way. So a lot more people are going to be talking about, you know, going to be adding onto the story. So your story is going to be the main the main circuits or the main <clears throat> I'm hearing attraction meaning just a lot of people are going to be aware of your story um a lot of people is going to find your story and they're going to be yeah they're 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 going to be flabbergasted by all of this yeah we have say here say is in reverse like they're not going to know what to say like they're going to hear everything what's going on and they're not going to know what to say. They're just going to be like flabbergasted by everything. Like, wow, this is this is really crazy. <clears throat> yeah, they're going to realize the trickery. They're going to realize the trickery. 
or everyone's going to see these people very tricky or like tricksters. <clears throat> they they seen it with their own two eyes. We also have pond as well too. It's in reverse. So that tells me that the secrets that were hidden underneath all of that debris is now being pushed up to the to the top. So nothing is hidden anymore. Nothing is deep. Nothing is sunken. It has risen to the top in that kind of way. <clears throat> but they're suffering with affliction. <laughs> Their suffering and their sorrows. The karmic are. Yeah, because the lights are on. And it's faded. Yeah. <laughs> now, this part here is not funny. This little part here. <clears throat> but someone's child is going to be taken away from them. Okay, so we have child. We have change. And we have message. They're going to be taken away from um, this parent here. Due to neglect. <clears throat> And abuse. It could be a sibling. <clears throat> Due to poverty and hardships as well, too. Okay, so this child will be removed from, um, yeah, time moment will be removed from this home. <clears throat> Yeah, so put it, so, you know, repossess is basically like taking something away in that kind of way. So, yeah, this, this child will be removed from the home because of all of the things that's happening here. And the child will be safe, okay? Yeah, joy. <clears throat> they, the people that are involved in all this, they're unable to express their emotions. They are very <laughs> frantic. They're very embarrassed. They're sad. They're angry. They're mad. They're going through a host of different emotions that they don't know how to maintain. <clears throat> no communication. So a sibling may lose their child. Okay. They're going to be very heartbroken. And yeah, they may lose their child to the system here <clears throat> because of illegal activities. <clears throat> could be a Capricorn, could be a Sagittarius, okay? Um, evictions, drug use, there's a lot of drugs around, pills, someone's being abusive here, all right, they're hood rats, all right, very trashy, could have been a secret lover that you may have not been aware of, of. <clears throat> They wanted to keep everything confused, but no one's confused by anything anymore. And um, this narcissist here that is going through all of this here, their, their worst nightmare is to be seen in a in a very negative light. And this is what's happening here. And they are so like, they're like, <laughs> they're losing their shit. They're like, what the fuck? Like, no one was supposed to know. Like this part of me, they lost their job. <clears throat> yeah, they lost their job. That's the secret. They don't want you to know. Yeah, this person is down and out. Someone could be pregnant here and they're trying to get this person to get an abortion. The person don't want an abortion because they want money. Yeah, they're a thief. So someone got pregnant just to just for the sake of getting pregnant. <laughs> uh, yeah, user pretending. <laughs> Yeah, for financial success. Yeah, that's what they did. Yeah. They're not going to get no money, though. They're not going to get anything. Sucks to be them. So they had sex with somebody to um for a financial come up. This person is very untrustworthy. They're suffering in silence. So whoever's pregnant here... They could be having complications with this pregnancy, too. They did all that. Yeah, it's a financial failure. They may lose this child. Yeah, they may lose this child because of it. It may put them in a depressive state. It may make them to drink. They're irresponsible. Could be a Leo you're dealing with. Take it how it resonates. It could be a Leo. Take it how it resonates. <clears throat>
regenerate is in reverse. So someone definitely drinks a lot and they love to put pills in their drinks. They love to mix their pills up with their drinks. I'm also hearing GHB. So someone could have slipped something in someone's cup and, um, dang, this turn left and went against. Yeah, so we have protection in reverse. So this could be a setup as well, too, in regards to trying to get pregnant. Somebody put something in someone's drink and then attempted to have sex with them. That's some real crazy shit, bro. <clears throat> That's real fucking foul and crazy. Yeah, we got patience in reverse. Yeah, this person did this dumb shit. Like, that's that's real fucking crazy. That's crazy. So the person that did this, that slipped someone a drink or a roofie or something like that, and they were trying to get pregnant by someone, they're having a lot of complications with this child. So that's for a very, that's for someone significant here. But somebody wanted to get pregnant so that way this child can become the cash cow. And you know, it's sad, it's fucking sad. They were being forced to get an abortion here. Shit. They were forced to get an abortion, but they didn't want the abortion. And it's like other avenues. It's kind of forcing this person to have a miscarriage now. Like, it's crazy. But it's going to be, it's not going to be, it's going to be hard for that person. We have mortality, death, strong framework, rebirth, abundance, beauty, and afterlife, need to restructure life, beauty, and death. And then we have hiding your true feelings, anxious, defensiveness against others on edge, overthinking and worrying, wasting time. So someone is going to be aware that this person, the only reason how this only reason why this person got pregnant is because of some really dark ways. And it's going to um, push this person away even further. Yeah, anger and passion is locked up. Anti-social tendencies, rejection, being, what's that? Being shut out of something, outcast. So this narcissist thought that they had pull a, 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 you know, a one up and they did not. Someone that they're with, they, they did it to them. Completely destroyed their life and they're like, what the fuck? They don't know if they're coming or going. <clears throat> like I said, I think I said Capricorn, Sage, and Leo so far. <clears throat> yep, turmoil and chaos, emotional stress, fallout with family or friends, loss, plans are at a standstill, destruction. The storm they never saw coming, or the storm they never saw brewing. <laughs> they never saw this storm coming because they were so worried or so tied up and trying to hurt or harm the collective. And look where this got them. We have masquerading, exploitation, insincere, take advantage of others' vulnerability, holier than thou, attitude, clout chasers. So not only um, are they masquerading as if they're like this good person, they're not, they're exploiting others for what they want, um, for their come up, for their for their wants and their needs. They're very insincere about it. And this person or group of people take a high resonance, take advantage of other people's vulnerability. They feel like by people being vulnerable, just out there open and vulnerable, um, that they consider them as weak. And being vulnerable or being in a vulnerable space is not being weak, okay? Um, Holier than thou attitude, clout chaser. So this person may say, oh, I believe in the divine. I believe in the Lord. I believe in a higher source here, but they don't. They just use the higher source's name or energy in vain. And it's causing them a lot of bullshit because of, of the choices they decide to make clout chaser. 
they like to piggyback off of other people's success here. But they never thought it would turn in this way because all of the the piggybacking on all of the attention that they're getting is very negative and they don't like it. They can't handle it. They can't handle the negativity. The thing was, they were supposed to put you in a negative position and then they were supposed to ride the coattail off of that. So they were supposed to uh, be jeering at you, uh, laughing and hee hee, ha ha, and bullying you and stuff like that. But that didn't happen. It's happening to them and they can't take it. Miscommunication and gossip. <laughs> Using intelligence in a negative way, unwanted news and expected and unexpected delays. So like this person is just like, I can't take this. I can't, I can't deal with people laughing at me and talking about me and stuff like that. They can't take that. Ain't that something? Oh, they can't take that shit whatsoever. <laughs> oh man, these people are weird. Because all of the confusion was supposed to be with you, not with them. So, um, so we have immortality, inner growth, strength, protection against evil, divine messages, resilience and determination, mindset shift. <laughs> That's you. Collective. You're very protected from against lower energies. You're very strong. Um, you listen to the messages that come from the divine. And you're shifting the way you, you view the world or your mindset here. And it's causing a lot of resilience and determination for you to keep moving forward here. And they're realizing there's nothing that they can do. They can't stop you from moving forward. And this is why they're going through so much here because they're trying to stop you. It's like they're trying to go against the flow of the universe, over, overcoming loss and sadness, living in the past, regretful, learning from lessons and mistakes. Oh, and they're learning really bad. <laughs> they're learning really bad. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -hmm. The magician is also here. <laughs> Ten of Wands, the death, and then the magician in reverse. They're really learning that the things that they have done towards you, not just you, but other people, is really backfiring. And it's like, I can't take this pressure. They lost a lot of money or they're losing a lot of money here. A lot. Damn. Shit, Ten of Pentacles. Damn, how you... It went from the nine to the ten. This is like financial ruins. The ten of pentacles is the highest pentacle in the um, deck. And it went from the nine of pentacles to the ten in reverse. Shit. You had the ten of wands, the death card. So they were overwhelmed, overburdened. Which caused a collapse, an ending, right? In their finances, in their money. Nine of pentacles and ten of pentacles. They have nothing, not a... Damn, they're in extreme regret because of this. Nine of Swords, they don't have anything. They don't they don't have anything to their name. But this is justice. Because all they cared about was money. And they're willing to do anything to capitalize off of other people's sadness or vulnerabilities. And that backfire. Big time. That backfire. Damn. <laughs> Man, that backfire big time. Golly. That backfire big time, child. Let's see what else. God damn. Five of Pentacles. All these Pentacles. <laughs> Wow, they are tired. Five of Wands, battle fatigue. They're tired. They're tired of arguing. They're tired of fighting. 
oh, they are tired. They're tired of all of this because they're losing money. Damn, they went from the nine of pentacles to the ten of pentacles, five of pentacles. That's like complete poverty. It's like shit. It's like no more, no more. Like they they throw in the the um the white flag. It's like I can't do I can't do this no more. No more. No more. Um, relationships are destroyed. Connections have been destroyed here. The lovers is in reverse. <laughs> <laughs> damn wheel of fortune damn <laughs> we got the wheel of fortune the king of cups and the king of swords <laughs> all in reverse the wheel of fortune um bad luck disappointments very upset um they have no control of, over the wheel the wheel is very oppressive very brutal very controlling um they feeling very very anxious very emotional because of it yeah, the, the universe is like really breaking them down. It's very brutal. Like the universe is like, okay, I got this now. Stand back. <laughs> and this, dang, these group of people here, the world. Dang, oh my God. All these major arcana's judgment. <laughs> seven, of, seven of cups, they have no, the star. They fucked. They, three of, damn. They trying to stand up to war. They trying to stand up against the universe. Let me know how that goes, boo. Let me know how that works out. They trying to stand up. <laughs> they trying to fight the universe. Okay, keep doing it. Keep doing it. Yeah, yeah. You gonna keep getting knocked the fuck out? Because <laughs> the universe don't play no chess. The universe play chess. <laughs> They really trying to go toe to toe with the universe. They feel like um, they can get, they can go against the flow. Okay, well, do you boo? <laughs> they feel like yeah, they are praying against a higher source, a higher power here. We got some really ballsy people, you know. But okay. Hey, have at it, boo. I, authentic is in reverse. Yo, they ballsy as fuck. <laughs> yeah, whoa, okay. Do you, boo? They are ballsy as fuck. And they getting fucked up. <laughs> oh, they're being pushed, forced into silence. Like, you won't stop? Okay. Mm -mm. to the point where their voice is going to be suppressed like their lies are going to be suppressed because it's not truthful and family here like this family is done rebirth is in reverse family's been dismantled or soon to be dismantled damn I'm telling you that last thing would not exist anymore for that bloodline, it won't exist anymore. It it is. They didn't create anything good with the name, so it won't exist. That's crazy shit. But they thought it was funny, so he who laughs last laughs the best, and the collective will laugh the best. <laughs> Oh, for sure. <laughs> They're not accepting that they lost. Okay, you don't have to. <laughs> but this is in reverse. They're losing everything. Soon these people are going to have to be in one household. And that'd be the worst thing ever. Can you imagine all of that negative energy in one household? Huh. <laughs> That's what the universe is pushing. Because everyone's losing their home, their car, and stuff like that. And eventually, all of these people, or so-called family members, or whatever you want to call it, are going to be in one home, eventually. 
And it's giving me like Carrie. Carrie vibes. Like you know what happened. You knew what happened to Carrie at the end. The first one. Not number two. Back in 1970s. That, that movie. And Carrie's mom didn't approve of her telekinesis power. And it got so bad that Carrie had to, you know, she had to, you know, her mom or whatever. And it's just kind of giving me that vibe, like how the house kind of closed or encased in, like everything just kind of fall in. That's just what it's giving me. Like everyone is going to be forced to live in this home together because they have no other place to live. They're going to be forced by the universe to come together, to live together in one household. And that one household is going to be destroyed. I just see the home just caving in. That's just what I see. Mm. Yeah, regret, fa shit, failure. <laughs> they regret that shit. They worry. They cry silently. <laughs> Why would you be crying silently? Make that make sense. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> they want out. They want freedom. <laughs> they want freedom. They want out of this. <laughs> oh my God. They're in grief. <laughs> They're... <laughs> <laughs> they have no courage <laughs> to fix the adversity they have the they don't know what to do they're gonna be suffering in the home all of them <laughs> like roaches <laughs> suffering like roaches <clears throat> in this home and this home is not protected none it's not protected i'm telling you this home is not strong it the like the foundation of the home is not structured it's not it's 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 not protected um i just see the home just falling in like coming in caving in closing in illumination is in reverse they can't they don't see this coming here sadness they are scared they're scared and they're sad well because the the movements of the magic has been reversed back or turned back to them it has stopped dead in its tracks and it has pushed pushed back to the people that did this dumb shit here they have no peace <laughs> frustrated <laughs> they're seeing um paranormal activity <laughs> it's causing anxiety i just keep hearing um i'm sorry y'all <laughs> i just keep hearing in the name of jesus that's all i keep hearing the blood of jesus that's all i keep hearing but someone is yelling and screaming so this is a karmic that's doing this. Y'all forgive me. But um, I just keep hearing, in the name of Jesus, the blood, the blood of Jesus. And this person is holding on to a Bible. And I just keep seeing all these like different types of spirits and entities in this person's home. And it's funny because they were calling, they were summoning these spirits to hurt you. And like I said, if you've been doing your return to sender, <laughs> you'll get strong confirmation. And here's one of your confirmations here that they're, they're, um, I'm hearing psycho fans. Hold on. Psycho fans. What is that? Psycho. Is that a word? Psycho fans. Hold on one second. Yes, psychopaths. S Y C O P H A N T. Okay. A person who acts 
obsessively towards someone important in order to gain advantage. Hmm. What? Someone who praises powerful or rich people in a way that is not sincere, usually in order to get some advantage from them. Ah, okay. And it's spelled S Y C O P H A N T. Sycophant. Sycophant. I'm sorry. Sycophant. <laughs> um. So it feels like these people want to. Yeah, they're the sycophants. Hmm. They want to show you fake love, basically. That's basically what it is. They're showing you fake love to get on your good side. And this is what they're going to attempt to do because they can't get no rest. They need help. They need help with um, getting rid of those spirits in their home. <clears throat> Disruption. They, they need some kind of help here. No. I'll let y'all sit and play with the spirits. Y'all call, called upon the fucking spirits. Get rid of them. Why do you need the collective? You the one that called upon the them, you get rid of it. Shit. Um, caution. Happiness is in reverse. Fear is upright. And them spirits is doing a number on them. I mean, y'all called them in. Y'all the one invite them in your home. Shit. Y'all the one doing uh Bible verses and mirror mirror uh mirror uh tricks and shit. It can't be stopped. <laughs> it cannot be stopped. They pulled out some really dark entities. Entities. Yes, they did. Yes, they did. And they are going to be... <laughs> it's like they're going to be spooked to death. <laughs> if that's the <a> thing. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> They're going to be spooked to death. So, oh, yeah, like, <laughs> we got filled, like, their home is going to be filled with nothing but spirits. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> spirits unwell unwell spirits that they've conjured up that is in their home that they can't get rid of spirit box they were playing with they could have been playing with the Ouija board <clears throat> <laughs> they was man they it's some crazy shit they were even summer some summoning like old family members that had passed away and these family members that had passed away do not fuck with them at all and they're summoning them they got no <laughs> They have no knowledge as to how <laughs> how spirituality works. And it, it just shows. Yeah, they reached out to um to to loved ones that has transcend already. <clears throat> and these loved ones they're calling upon. They're like, why the fuck are you calling upon me? Like you didn't show me no respect when I was alive. Why you know in that kind of way? Like, they didn't show them no respect ever. So, it's just weird that, like, why are you why are you summoning me to help you with this dumb shit in that kind of way? And dumb spirits is fucking up their ass. God damn for the things that they have done here. Truth. 
That is the truth. I don't know when the last time these karmics got a good night's sleep. I'm not even going to lie to you. They scared to go to sleep. They sleep in turns and shit. Like... <clears throat> they're having a cow. <laughs> like they're calling for help. Because all they were was just material based. Yeah, that's all they were, material based. Who got what? Who got this? If you don't got that, they not you not better than them. You gotta have a certain thing, a certain car, a certain whatever, and you you know that's the only way that you can so called be better than them. Child, please. Walmart got good jeans on sale for how much? Oh, okay. Let me get me up here. Let me go to Rawls real quick. Let me go to Marshalls. Let me go to Target, okay? It's about you and how you style yourself. Not the clothes, boo. It's you. <laughs> Shit, I'll go to the Goodwill, too. I like me a good uh, good Goodwill uh, run or a trip real quick. Because sometimes you can find some really good stuff here. So, anywho. Uh, they like the expensive stuff. It ain't nothing wrong with it. It's nothing wrong with that. But what's wrong with how they're acting towards getting these expensive things is that this is how they view the world. If you don't have that, you're nothing. Oh, well, okay. Most of my great clothes and finds be through Walmart and shit. Like, Target is, where you get that from? Ross. <laughs> All these, you know, all these got a clothing section in, the, in their store, too. They don't sleep on all these now. Okay, JC Penny, you know, Macy's, you know. You know. <laughs> Anywho. <clears throat> yeah, certain spells, so they, they abide it by or they live by a certain spell. And a certain spell was more so... When you are seen, you need to be seen. Like you got to be dressed to the nines and all this stuff. I'm also being seen but not heard. So this is something that you may have lived at, live under when you were smaller. You must be seen but not heard. Um, only speak when you are spoken to. That type of dumb shit. Like real cutthroat, organized living state. Like there was no cutting corners. This is how it was. And this is the only way it's going to be in that kind of way. Because they said so. Yeah, since you were a child, since you were young, you had some really strict bullshit rules that you had to abide by and follow. <clears throat> yep, that's a fact. And you could not ask any questions. You just have to follow and listen to what they said. Like you were not allowed to go down the rabbit hole. You were not. You were not allowed to do to to research anything like that. You may have to do research on your own time. <clears throat> you may have to read on your own time, or maybe some of you guys may have to like sneak to read. You couldn't read. Or read what you wanted to read. You had to read what was given to you in that kind of way. Like you weren't able to express your, the things that you wanted to do. If it didn't go with what they said, you couldn't do it. <clears throat> and now that you're an adult, you can do it now. So no excuses. The things that you weren't able to do as a child, make sure you do it now. Whatever that is, eating ice cream in the cold winter time, going outside barefoot, whatever. However, things that you could not do and you know you can do now, do it, boo. Reinvigorate that inner child spark. Because it's going to bring out that glow even more. <laughs> For real. Yeah, new life. <laughs> you have all the time in the world. Spirit is going to make sure of that. 
on your own terms, your own time, whatever you want to do, okay? Things were not fair before, but it is now, okay? It's going to be. They didn't want you to be this energy poise. They did not want you to be in the poise energy. They didn't want you to be in your energy. They wanted you to be, like, basically, they wanted you to be on... <clears throat> So this is like a zoo in a way, kind of. Like you see the different animals and there's a bird, there's an owl, there's a parrot, there's a giraffe. And there's actually a person on here, right here. See the person on there? Then it says hotel. I don't know, it just kind of gives me like a hotel is a community thing. Anyone can go to a hotel if you have the money, right? I don't know, it just gives me like display, like you were put on display for everyone to see, but they needed you to be seen in a certain way. Yeah, like a more like a business. <clears throat> so they pay people to view you in a certain way, which is just fucking weird, but whatever. <clears throat> now, they don't have to pay anyone anything because now people just see who they are stupidly for free. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Chaos and, and conflict and then go to distance. They went really far as to how far you know, they went really far in regards to attempting to like, you know, destroy your life and shit like that. I want some spring rules. <laughs> I think I'm gonna make it come today. Yeah, that sounds good. Spring rules. Oh, with some peanut sauce. <laughs> the right one. <laughs> they do not have the world in their hand they're being forced to clean up their own mess and it's faded <laughs> they can't breathe or more so they feel very um They feel like they don't have enough space to do as they please. They feel restricted. They feel suffocated by the universe, by the divine. And they're trying to get out of that. They're asking why they're not flexible, why they can't get out of this. They feel stuck and they can't get out of it. They want to be stimulated or they want the universe to re-stimulate them. energy and victory they have no energy to get to the victory to get to the finish line you could be dealing with an aries aries or virgo so you could be an aries you could be a virgo they could be things are not balanced for them in their life here they have no energy to move forward <clears throat> they have no money they have no energy they, they don't have anything Vitalities in reverse. You could be dealing with a Taurus. You could be a Taurus. They could be a Taurus. Three plus two is five. Some really big changes. Two plus seven is nine. The ending of these changes. Damn. They're no longer in this leadership role that they created for themselves. Clarity is in reverse. 
All right, Virgo. Could be a Virgo. You could be, they could be. They don't have any productivity. Could be a Cancer. They could be. They also don't have no protection, which is Aries. A lot of Aries involved. Positivities in reverse. Could be a Leo. They could be a Leo. They do not trust the universe. <laughs> Well, I mean, you know, you're fighting against it. Shit, you could be a Scorpio. They could be. Two plus one is three. Mind, body, and soul. They're not in agreement. They're not in alignment with the universe here. So this is why they're fighting against it. They don't understand the terms, the terms and conditions of working with the universe. So because you don't understand, they have no gratitude to show. And they have the courage. This is why they feel they have the courage to go up against the universe. So you could be a Libra. They could be a Libra. Or a Gemini. And the universe is like, oh, okay. You want This is what you want to do? All right, I got you. You want to go against me? I got you. In that kind of way. They going up against the universe, child. And we all know what happens when, they, when people do their shit. <laughs> There's a force field around the, 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 the earth. There's a force field around the, the solar system. The same things, the same particle and energies that made us, you don't think that can... Okay, whatever. What do I know? <laughs> what do I know? Uh, if learning the hard way was... Man, some people just gotta learn the hard way. And they do. Exploration. The universe is going to definitely grant them and let them explore the darker parts of the world, of the of the universe, of the energies. This ride is on hell. <laughs> They're literally going to hell in a handbasket. <laughs> For real. Yeah, source, sun is source. <laughs> That's the universe community. Like the sun or source is not giving them any type of nothing. Like no energy, no nothing. Could be a Leo as well too. Like you don't have enough energy to face the community. Community is Aquarius. 11th house I think is, a, is, run, is a, ruled by Aquarius if I'm not mistaken communities the sun is not in support of what they've been doing or the universe the source higher self or higher source is not yes yeah, someone's definitely dealing with the leo here and there's a lot of changes a lot of change because this is also leo too the sun represents leo Damn. They can't cultivate anything. They don't have any money. You could be dealing with a tourist. They have no money. No future. No more. They have no. So they will, they will not be making any money in the future. Damn. I'm going to stop right there. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking devils. <laughs> that is what you call no. <laughs> magic art someone it could be maggie you may cook with maggie cubes 
or bouillon cubes. You could be from Austin, Texas. Your name could be Nate, Nathaniel, Natalie. You may like Nat King Cole. They're banned. <laughs> They're banned from the spiritual world. <laughs> what the fuck? How the fuck you banned from the spiritual world? That's some crazy shit. Somebody could be from Atlanta, Minnesota. All right, you may work with this energy called Monat. All right, Monat. All right, she's a beautiful energy to work with. You may be dealing with gnats in your home. If you have gnats in your home, that means that um, you have spies. Okay, so you may have like fruit flies or like spies. They say when you see flies in your home, that's a sign of spies, spiritual, spiritually, okay? Somebody is riding the broad street line. Somebody is a Boric, Bice, Bo, mm, Boric, Boricua, Boricua. I think that means pretty, if I'm not mistaken. Somebody's sister is really losing their shit. Somebody is really losing their shit. We warned you not to do this dumb shit. We warned you. So, um, people are seeing you rise or rising. You may love raisins. Raison means to be right in French. Um, somebody's at their max in regards to energy, like they can't do it anymore. They're at their max, like I can't do this anymore. It's, it's taking a toll on their body. Like me, me being wicked to others is taking a toll on their body. Ain't that something, child? Huh. Being mean and wicked to others is taking a toll on these karmic's body. Ain't that something? You gonna stop now? No? Oh, okay. Well, keep going, boo. The more you keep going, the more the universe is gonna keep slamming you. Like, just fucking slamming you, bruh. But keep going, boo. Keep going. We're rooting for you, Karmic. I'm hearing Hashimoto. I think that's a form of a ailment. Hashimoto. Someone's from Mexico. Someone loves to sing. Someone named is Tony. You could have gone to the Tony Awards. I think that's country, if I'm not mistaken. You may love Tony Braxton. Someone has BV, bacterial vaginosis. Someone's having a boy, XY. Someone's having twins, XY, XX. Someone's having twins, a boy and a girl. Congratulations. Somebody is getting new glasses or prescription. I can see um, we have squint, S-Q-U-I-N-T. So you could be squinting, okay? You're gonna, get a, you're gonna get a good deal with your glasses. Someone likes the Vikings. Someone's very honest, or you may like the honest, um, uh, what's that drink? Uh, it's by honest. I think it's like green tea or iced tea or something like that, but is it? a brand called Honest and they sell different types of teas. So that might be your favorite tea to drink. Someone loves the Backstreet Boys. Someone lives in Vietnam or may have served in Vietnam. Thank you for your service. 
We have Nam. So someone definitely served in Vietnam. Someone's from Iowa, Idaho, Hong Kong. Someone loves Tang. I don't know if that's still a thing. Tang, T-A-N-G. Someone loves Brisk to drink, B-R-I-S-K. All right, someone loves to listen to the radio more than like TV. Someone loves the radio. It don't matter. They just love listening to the radio, like the cracklings of it. All right, we got Scorpio, Fifth House, and Mercury. Seventh House, Saturn, Taurus, Leo, Saturn, Seventh House. Fourth house in Taurus. So fourth house is family. Somebody's family is being completely uprooted. Definitely Taurus. So Taurus family. Um, we also have Aquarius. Fifth house. All right. So dealing with the action Aquarius. So Aquarius, Taurus, Gemini. Taurus, Cancer, oh, Pisces, let's do four more, damn, a lot of Taurus, Leo, this is a lot, Scorpio, one more, and I did say Leo a lot too, Capricorn, okay, yeah, this is, oof. anywho, if that resonates, please like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Till next time. <laughs>